A group plans to march after the controversial tortilla throwing incident at a high school basketball game between Coronado High and Orange Glen High. Parents and students are now worried for their safety. News 8's Ariana Cohen talked with a Coronado parent and a march participant. A march against racism is set to take place at Coronado High Saturday, and it has many parents concerned and worried. My son was at this basketball game that has caused a firestorm in our community and also with Orange Glen. A Coronado mother's son attended the division championship basketball game Saturday where tortillas were thrown during a fight between Coronado High and Orange Glen High, a predominantly Latino high school. I don't want to see violence coming our to our, into our community. I don't. Coronado's basketball coach was fired after what happened. Now a nonprofit organization, We Stand United SD, is planning a march against racism at 5 p.m. at Coronado High School Saturday called Racism Has No Place Here. Now the mother fears what may happen at the march. Our kids are getting death threats. We're going to have to get a, go to a hotel and get off the island on Saturday. You know, we have community members who are scared. Tasha Williamson is participating in the march. We're no longer afraid to talk about racism. Some are even saying that they don't even want to play basketball anymore because they're afraid that they're going to be, whether violence brought upon them. They want to come march. I'll even stand with them. But at the same time, we're not going to condemn violence. Racism has damaged um, these children. These children are not sleeping. Unsportsmanlike conduct is not deserving of a champion. We need to defuse the fire and we need to defuse the hate. CIF is expected to make a decision next week. Some have been calling for Coronado High to be stripped of its championship title. Ariana Cohen, News 8.